and some scary moments in Haddam after a small plane slams into a house. We're learning more about the pilot this morning, 46-year-old Benjamin Temple. He's from East Rockaway, New York. News 8's Renee Schmiel spoke with witnesses and a man who was inside the home when that plane crashed. It's pretty scary. What started as a relaxing Saturday afternoon at Eagle Landing State Park in Haddam turned frightening. Witnesses saw a small plane take off from Goodspeed Airport across the Connecticut River, but they soon saw something was wrong. I was looking right at it. It was unbelievable. It just come up and it wasn't that high. And how he cleared those trees, I have no idea. It's a good thing it didn't come straight across because it would have uh, maybe hit some people. Though it missed the park, it landed on this house nearby. A viewer sent us this picture. And when the plane crashed down, Norman Hannenbaum was inside. All of a sudden, I heard this huge crash. And I was probably no more than three feet, four feet from where the ceiling caved in. Hannenbaum thought it was a tree at first. He didn't hear the plane coming. And it wasn't until he got outside that he saw what had really fallen into his home. A couple of my neighbors said there was a plane up there. I said, what? A plane? Afterward, emergency responders from East Haddam and Haddam, as well as the FAA and state police arrived. They kept everyone away from the plane, which had taken down some power lines. About 300 people nearby were without power. Meanwhile, Hannenbaum may now have to rebuild his house. Half of the plane is uh, inside the uh, house. Just a few feet from where I was. Boy, I was I lucky. Thank you, dear God. Uh. Renee Schmiel, News 8. Absolutely.